Network operators often experience high costs and delays in their current mode of operation due to training personnel to acquire new skills, preparation work, frequent truck rolls for on-site interventions, and human errors. This mode of operation causes longer lead times to maintain and expand their networks and introduce new services for their customers, all at higher costs and impact to the environment. Nokia's Network Services Platform, or NSP, has addressed these operational pain points by taking a use case approach that is helping our customers achieve their business goals faster, greener, and at lower costs. Let's see how the zero-touch provisioning use case from the NSP has fully automated the process of commissioning a new IP router. Our customers have measured this process in their network and concluded that it is four times faster using the NSP as compared to their current mode of operations. Let's have a look at how NSP is achieving these efficiencies. At this instance, a request to commission a new IP router has been received at the Network Operations Centre. The operator starts the pre-commissioning phase by using the NSP with predefined intent-based provisioning templates and automation workflows. This phase includes preparation and validation of the configuration and data files required for the new router. It also includes configuration of the upstream router to take the role of a DHCP server. The commissioning phase starts once the new IP router is powered up and requests an IP address from the DHCP server. In return, the DHCP server provides a temporary IP address to the new router, along with the location of the required files. The new router uses this information to download the configuration and data files and applies them by performing a reboot. Now the new router is ready to be discovered and managed by the NSP, and it is fully integrated into the network. The zero-touch provisioning is one of the many use cases provided by the NSP, helping our customers improve and fully automate their network operations.